What up, YouTube dudes? What's going on, y'all, man? We got It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia, Season 5, Episode 5. That's right, 5-5. Five, five. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video and y'all want to see more videos, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Check out the playlist. We got lots more videos on there. And if you have any suggestions for other stuff that you want to see me react to, go ahead and drop a comment. Let me know what you think. Let's go. No, what do you think? It's kind of doing nothing for my hip area and making a mess of my boobs. You know what? Why don't you go grab five more? Look, we don't normally do this, but I think I'm gonna need some proof that you're actually getting married. What? Why? Because you've been coming in here and trying on wedding dresses every Saturday for over a year now? Yeah, that's because it takes a really long time to plan a wedding. Don't get up all over my balls, Lucy. Just go get the dresses. When is the wedding? Soon. Where? A church. Which one? The nearby one. The nearby one? The, right down the street. Which street? Spring. What's your fiance's name? Sam. What does he do? S salt. Salt? He's sea salt. Sea salt. He's a salt seaman. He's, he dives in to the ocean for the sea salt. And then he brings it back up, and then we eat it, so. OK, I'm getting the manager. Well, don't get the. <sighs> D. Reynolds? Yeah. Brad Fisher, from <gasps> high school. Brad Fisher. <laughs> no way! Yeah. You look amazing! Yeah. Your acne cleared up really well. I kind of grew into myself. Yes, <laughs> you did. Yes, you did. Why did I ever break up with you? you it was because of the acne. Was it because of the yeah, acne? Yeah, yeah. Uh, when it got real bad, you dumped me and you said it was because I was going to grow up to look like Edward James Olmos. Uh, I don't really remember saying exactly that. It's, but... it's fine. We were kids. We were kids. We were kids! Yeah. <laughs> we're not kids anymore. No. <laughs> Great. Wow. So you're, you're getting married. Wow. Yeah, uh, no, I'm not. I'm not. This is because I was, but that, that didn't work out. Why okay. are you asking? Are you single? What's your situation? I'm, I'm engaged. Oh. Yeah, and that's why I'm here. My fiance is trying on a dress. I know I'm not supposed to see it before the wedding, but we're having a whole non-traditional kind of cool. small thing. So you should meet a babe. Nah. I, yeah. Come here for a sec. I want you to meet a friend of mine. What do you think of this one, Brad? It's, it's beautiful, yeah. Oh, my god. <laughs> a snake, honey? It's a wasp. Is that your? All right, well, just don't. Sorry about all that. So he's not gonna tell us her name. Okay, they never say her all name. All right, well, dude. just don't no, poke at it. Don't just, just get it safely down into the box. Dude, you're gonna agitate yeah, the bees. Yeah, bees Well, I'm fine with the bees. It's the honey I don't want to agitate. Is that your end game here, honey? Yeah, I figure we keep the hive in the basement. We'll always have honey. We'll always have bees, is what we'll always have. Whoa! What, what? I think I just saw a wasp. I think that was a wasp. Did you see that? It, it looked, looked like a wasp, like a right? Is this a wasp nest? This is a wasp nest. I'm out! Right. I'm out! Yeah, yeah. I don't want to tangle with a bunch of wasps. Hey! Do, uh, do wasps make honey? No. No, wasps do not make honey. All right, well, I'm going to check it out anyway. There could be something delicious in here that wasps do make, and I want that. Matt, Dennis, can I talk to you in the office, please? Why can't we just talk right here? Yeah. Because it's private. Oh, that sounds like a whole thing. I'm not into it. Mm. Ah, 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 shit! I just got stung! That was a hornet! This is a hornet's nest! Uh, you know what, guys? Why don't we step in the back office while Charlie deals with this whole hornet wasp situation? Yeah. Oh, oh, I'm a bad boy. I'm a bad boy. Put some vegetable oil on it. That'll make you feel better. Okay, bye, sexy. Oh, who was that? It's my booty call. We're into some really weird food fetish stuff. <laughs> Gross. Okay, you guys, listen up. We got a serious problem. The waitress is getting married. Oh, yeah, I heard about that. Artemis told me. Since when do you talk to Artemis? She's my booty call. Weird. We'll get into that later. Who's right now, Artemis? we gotta deal with this waitress situation. Oh, Dee, why do you give that's a her shit friend. the waitress is getting married? She's been nothing but trouble for us. That's a good point. She doesn't seem to get our sense of humor. We do stuff that well, I think's funny. And Hilarious! Yes. Guys, I cannot believe you're not thinking about Charlie right now. This is gonna crush him. Wait, you don't give a shit about Charlie. All you care about is the fact the waitress is getting married before you, right? <laughs> that, or she's afraid that Charlie might blow his brains out, and then she'd have to do all the Charlie work. Uh, 
That's what it is. Okay, yeah. fine. A, I do no. not want to do Charlie's work once he kills himself. B, how could the waitress get married before me? I'm way hotter than she is. And C, get this, the guy she's marrying used to be my boyfriend. You know what I just realized? I don't care about anything she's saying. Not but what I do care about is the fact that Charlie might go postal if he finds out about this and kill all of us. Bingo, bitch. She doesn't embarrass herself. Like, oh, hey! Hey! You guys, how are you? All right, calm down. I'll be two seconds. Anyway, hi. How are you? What are you doing? OK, so listen up. I was thinking, since Brad, you were saying how your wedding was going to be all poor or boring or dull or whatever it was you, you were telling me. You said our wedding was going to be dull? I said it was going to be small. Small, yep, that's exactly what it was. Anyway, I was thinking I could help you guys out by throwing you a bachelorette party. And Brad, you can totally come since you guys decided to do that non-traditional mumbo good. jumbo. I think we're good. I think we're good. You know what, though? I kind of would like to meet some of your friends. Hold on here. Hold on. What am I hearing? You haven't met some of her great friends? Well, it's just because this happened really quickly. Okay. Okay. So yeah. Is it a yes or a no? Because you're kind of holding up traffic here. It's just it's rude. Well, look, I, I think it sounds great. OK, perfect. Sounds like Wonderful. Fun. We've got a deal. See you guys tomorrow night at my place at 8. <laughs> Bye, Brad. Good to see you. <laughs> That shit. Andrew, you got any bacon bits? We like to put them in Artemis's hair, and they rain down on me when we bang. I feel like a Cobb salad. <laughs> it's amazing. OK, I have no idea why anyone would want to feel like a Cobb salad, but whatever, that's good. Bring that up when Brad's here. Me, I broke Brad's heart in high school, and I feel really bad about it, OK? <laughs> Wait, you went to high school with us? Yeah, I sat right next to you in Trig. Huh. Wow, you are very forgettable. <laughs> Anyway, I, I will have you all know that I also broke Brad's heart in high school, so. You dated D? Mm. Briefly, yeah. We dated hard, yep. Both you girls dumped him because of his pizza face. Ooh, OK. Question number two. How many people in the room have had sex with the bride-to-be? <laughs> uh, just me, I hope. <laughs> Whoops. Uh-uh. Over here, guy. Ooh. OK, you know what? Uh, that, was a, that was a really dark time in my life, and it was a terrible mistake. No, it's true. To be fair, it's true. She's in love with my brother. They have a sex tape together. This guy no. came along. Was okay. I used to look like her. Give me my cigarettes. I, know, I, know. I didn't tell you to go. I didn't give you the high school. Everybody's just... stealing my Charlie girl! <laughs> oh, my God! <laughs> OK, Brad, I think it's time for us We're to gonna go. We're going to leave. All right. No, 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 Brad. No, don't leave yet. I'm sorry. Hold on. No, no, don't leave. Sweaty in the bathroom. Sure hey, do you suck? Don't sweaty in my bathroom. Just get out of here. Fuck with me. Okay, we'll go get sweaty in a Wendy's bathroom. Great, go Plus have sex at Wendy's. Wonderful. Get out of here. This party sucks. You suck. I need a ride. Oh, really? Well, I ain't giving you shit, you old bitch. Oh my God, no! You can't borrow salad dressing or condiments or anything else that you two want to jam up into each other's. I uh, I forgot something. Oh, what? I forgot to tell you. I still love you. Ah. Uh, uh, what a loser. She's gross, bro. How could you like that bitch? Are you Charlie Kelly? Yeah. So he's attractive. Yeah. But I'm sorry, I'm late. Um, she's a bad person. I would yes, never I fuck with her. More than just like Are you okay? Banging her or something one time. Yeah, this I, I was She's gross. running. Her personality is not attractive. Because you're, you're bleeding. Oh, shit. Is it bleeding again? It's funny. I'm sorry. For TV. These are hornets things, you know? I run into, like, like a lot of, like, hornets in my line of work, and I get stung up, like, bad all over my face and stuff, and then, you know, it starts bleeding. <laughs> oh. Sounds interesting. Yeah. What, what is it that you do again? I work, I'm like a janitor. I, um, I'm a full-on rapist, you know? Um, <laughs> Africans, <laughs> dyslexics, children, that sort of thing. I'm sorry. Did you say you're a full-on rapist? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, 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 no. I help, I help people, you know what I mean? I'm a, I'm a, a full, a full, a full, a full, a philanthropist? Yeah, that's exactly what it is. It gets 
blocked up in my mouth, I don't say it in those words. Oh. I'm the janitor at a bar. Oh, God, dude, I'm sucking ass. Yeah, dude, you said you were a rapist. Oh. I went crazy in the brain for a second, and my yeah. eyes were all like, uh, I couldn't think straight. That shirt is ruined. I know, dude, give me your shirt. What? Give me, it's a totally different shirt. Are you gonna hear you? How the hell are you going to explain that? I'll say I met a nice guy in the bathroom and we traded shirts. Are you listening to yourself? Jesus Christ. I'm freaking out. Okay, Don't new plan, him. new plan, new plan. Charlie, make a move. Okay. Just tell her you want a banger. Ooh, 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 no, I, that's, is that how you get checks? Well, he's got a 50-50 shot. That's you know, a good point. Yes or no scenario. It is a no scenario. <laughs> Why? Don't approach her that way. That's not going to work. Look, I'm getting the shirt. You're not going to get the shirt. All right, this is what you're going to do. Go back out there, start asking her questions about herself, talk to her about being a lawyer. She's going to be okay? gone if she's smart. Not, right? Right, that's gonna work, and then if anything uh, goes wrong, I'll come out there. I'll say I'm the manager of Gorgino's. Do you understand? Okay, fine. all right. All right, I got it. I got it. No, we'll you good? Then we'll be good. All right, great. Uh, She's gone, dude. Uh, is he... There's no way that bitch is there. You said you was a full-on rapist. Just go. Just go. Oh, just get out. Come on. Just, just get yeah, back yeah. out there. Yeah. Oh, she stayed too hey, desperate. I'm sorry about that. It took she's a little desperate. while. There was a guy in the bathroom. He wouldn't give me a shirt, and I was fighting. I'm like, give me your shirt, bro. And he didn't want to give it to me, and it was like a whole thing. Hi, uh, uh, hi. Uh, I'm the manager, and Mr. Kelly is one of our preferred customers. It's oh. so wonderful to see you right. here uh, my again good this evening. Uh, now, I'm going to want the milk steak boiled over hard ah. and a side of your finest jelly beans raw. <laughs> 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 Mr. Kelly, you have the most wonderful sense of humor. Hey, I own this joint, and I know this guy, and he is loaded. Mr. Kelly, we have your milk boiling just the way you like it back there for your steak. You're going to like this. How's about I clear out the coat room, and you guys hit it in there while the steak is getting ready? What? What in the hell are you doing? <laughs> this is going to be great. I've Charlie, this. make a move, Maul. No, no, don't. Oh, my God! Oh, no. ah! I'm what leaving. You're grabbing her breasts? What are you doing? No, what does making moves mean? Well, it doesn't, it doesn't mean doesn't... stab at her breasts with your fingers. Oh, Come on, man. bro, you're ordering milk steak and jelly beans. <gasps> what the you fuck is milk steak? Is that a real thing? Oh, great, I had it, man. You did not have it. Hey, what's, what's, uh, what's this? This is for your engagement, man. Uh, you're lucky. Lucky dude, and uh, congratulations, oh, dude. No, 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 that's, that's not happening anymore. We're not, uh, we're not engaged. You're not getting married? Nah. Oh, you're Charlie Kelly, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember you from high school. Hang on a second, dude. Uh, you're not getting married? Well, <clears throat> remember how uh, everybody used to, to make fun of us in high school? Remember how they made fun of you? Anyway, I have been getting my revenge. I've been getting engaged to all these chicks who broke up with me in high school because of my acne, and then I dump them right before the wedding. Damn. <laughs> yeah, I just got through doing it to that coffee shop waitress. Now I'm going to do it to this chick, Dee Reynolds. Remember her? She was the worst. Yeah, uh, so, so that coffee shop waitress, she must have been hurt kind of bad by that, though, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. She was, she was devastated. Oh. So. Well, tell you what, man. Why don't you go ahead and have this present anyway? Really? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I feel like you deserve it. <laughs> oh, thanks, dude. Yeah. That's, that's, that's red. All right. It's well, Hornets, man. Keep it real, man. Okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> He's about to get D'd up. Why don't you warn D? I mean, fuck her. She's a bad person. I I actually think that what he's doing to all those girls that were mean to him in high school is, is like the most brilliant idea ever. Like, kudos to that guy for that. I mean, it's fucked up, but damn, bro. I mean, you know, it's... <laughs> I'm glad he's doing it. Subscribe.